Greetings everyone and welcome back to RimWorld and of course to Stygian Sanctuary where things are not going too badly for the colony honestly though uh, things could be better it's getting very very cold things can always be better though but as you can see our uh, moisture pumps are actually starting to uh, expand out now and uh, correct some of the issues that we had around here it's going to take a long time for that to finish though and i'm getting a little bit concerned about the uh, lack of power to this part of the colony in particular now Ultimately, I want some sort of defenses around here that will help to uh, attack anyone trying to move through this uh, little tunnel there. But that doesn't mean that we can't look at setting up a geotherm. So at the moment, as uh, so you can see, I've switched back to this gorgeous mod. Honestly, this mod is absolutely wonderful. I've, I've really uh, experienced a mod that, that I would select this purely because of how it looks, even if there was a better functioning mod. This one just feels so nice. But uh, we've switched over to Geo... Oh, rather, there we are. Switched over to Geothermal Power so that we can uh, get that up and running as soon as we can. And once we've got that, I would actually much like to remove these entirely. And uh, by removing these, I would then have all of this under cover and I could actually just have... Uh, hay grass being grown here, but we have got some traders. Ooh, fantastic. Uh, could you go out and grab that for me? In fact, could you also not grab all of that for me? I don't want those brought in. Definitely bring in the hair though. That's fine uh, Bring in food, but don't go out there to bring in rocks. Basically. We don't care for them um, You can come in as well anything else died due to the extreme cold no, it doesn't look like it. That's fine then. We've got some uh, wolves up there. We're also bringing in some some wood here and there, hither and yon. Right. Okay. So, with all that done, uh, we do need to get this sorted. And unfortunately, unless we can get some more um, slate, that's going to be a bit of a problem. Actually, let's have a look at this item stash opportunity. Psychoid leaves, marble blocks, sandstone blocks, and gold. The gold might be worth it. Um... Enemy turrets. How far away is this, Lilith? Also, love your name. Oh, that tea is gorgeous. Uh, let's see. Ooh, that's a bit of a ways, and we are actually starting to move into the sort of um, winter time. We'd only be able to move along the road so much of it. Then we'd have to cross a mountain. That's 18.1 days, assuming regular speed. No, it, it's the wrong time of year for us to go for that kind of, which is a big old shame. Actually, it's a massive shame, but oh uh, well. You can't win them all as much as I'd like to. Uh, right. Anything else we particularly want to do right now? I'm not so sure. We've got uh, this being set up over here. And you know what? Let's uh, actually move a couple of things in there. So first a light, and then I would also like a second one just there. And I do believe that we have this. Uh, limestone pot, it has Flurgle stumbling forward with a psychotic look on her face and because of the stress she's grimacing in misery. Um, well, maybe we'll pop that in the in the hospital and it can, it can sort of be a reminder. It's like, look, things could be worse. You could be stumbling around in a psychotic state and, you know, giving in to misery. I'm not really sure that is the best thing to have there, but, you know, it's, it's what I'm putting there. Uh, what else have we got? We've got some really nice sculptures, actually. Number one for Dark Avak. One for Avak, sorry. Uh, teaching a husky obedience while wondering what's for lunch. Husky looks uh, puzzled. That's superior. And we have Dark Avak's work. Dark Avak seems to be a favourite amongst the artists. Uh, elbow deep in Wilson during surgery. Blood pooling at his... Uh, well, blood pools at his feet and he has blood smeared on his face. Because, look, basically, having Dark Avak do surgery on someone is like having a very hungry person cooking other people food. Really, really delicious food. Every now and then, he just, he, look, he, you know, after he's cut someone over the scalpel, who's, who minds if he just, you know, gives it a lick before he puts it down? Maybe accidentally smearing some across his cheek in, in an amazing setup for potentially a, a moment far in the future where he asks people how he got these scars or if they want to know. Uh, right, let's get all of this hauled in as a priority because we really do want that sorted. And you know what else we want to do? We want to finish off this trap, mate. So let's get all of these all the way down. Oh, okay, we'll go down that far, I suppose. And get an extra door right there, I think would be a grand. There we go. Just mining out this little area. Again, as much of the slate as we possibly... Ooh, 
A group of mechanoids from a mechanoid hive have arrived nearby. Oh, right, what are you armed with? A heavy charge blaster, minigun, inferno cannon, that's bad. Inferno cannon, that's also bad. The rest, not so much of a concern. Uh, uh, that's actually super not good. Okay, so what we need to do then, a couple of things. First and foremost, all the animals, Yoko alert. Secondly, all the people, home. There you go. Now, with this, you should still be able to do the work. Have we got enough? Yes, we do, thank oh, goodness. Actually, that only needs five. So, uh, Dark Avak, please get to work on these right now. Go, 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 go. Get that stuff down there. Get this place sealed off. Get everyone else indoors, please. Oh, they are coming fast. Uh, let's get all of these active. All of these active. Dark Ava, can you move, work on the other one? There we go. And finish that off. Glorious, get indoors. There we are. Turn them all on. They will be here soon. Thankfully. Oh, that's glorious. Well bloody done. Now, how are they splitting up? Hmm. Okay. Well, this isn't the worst. This isn't the worst. Dark Avak, gonna need you stood guard around here. KD, um, just want you inside along with Rhapsody. Don't go outside at all. Wilson, um, you can stand there. Valerie, you can be here. Bubbles, you can be there. Kaya, you can stand guard there. Madden, around here. Janna, 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 Janna. I would like you to equip the EMPs. Flurgles, you can be there. Horror story. And I think we're good. Get to your positions, everyone. Oh dear, that is the part that I was worried about. Please keep on the move, horror story. Keep on the move. Don't let it get another shot. Ah! Oh, blah, 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 blah. That was potentially super duper bad. Thankfully, you're alive. And for this, I am super duper happy. Okay, let's, uh, <laughs> fantastic. Absolutely glorious. Uh, it's going to take forever for these things to get down here, though. I could go out there and just have a fight with it. I suppose that is possible. Um, let's get you up there. You're going to hang tight there, Jan. Really, do you need to break that? Look, I know everyone is going to undraft in a moment. Really? Really? You're going around? Why? Ah, oh, no, they're drawing drawing them in. That is so bad. All right. Now, there. Let's keep throwing. There we go. All of the guns all the time, please. All right, for that matter, Dark Ava, get down there. Wilson, get down there. Kaya, down there. Bubbles, down behind Kaya. This way you'll be able to shoot. Well done. Hopefully the guns will stop. Good. Let's wait for the other others to come through. And you just keep keep throwing there. That's fine. Bubbles. Right by there, please. Where are you going? Come back. There we go. Another one down. Now this is the one we really need to kill. Oh my lord, that was good. This is working much better than I expected, I'll be honest with you. Was not expecting this to be as, as uh, effective as it has been. Go ahead. Just attack with whatever you can. Actually, stop, because you're going to break the, the walls eventually. So stop forced attack. Wait for something bad to come through. They nearly died because of the cold. That will happen from that time again. Oh, dear. The wall is getting absolutely destroyed by all this firepower, but that's fine. Um, better that wall go down than us have this thing reactivate. Please kill it. Oh, good job, everyone. Okay, you're good, you're good, you're good, you're good, you're good. Wow. All right. That was not actually a, a bad little uh, setup there. Do need to replace those walls, but as far as things go, that could have been significantly worse. Well done, everyone. I am pretty proud of you, actually. Uh, also, let's train these huskies. Major break risk. Bubbles is just really annoyed. Why, Bubbles? That was an amazing victory. And you were integral to it. Let's have a look. Hungry, tired, ugly environment that is. Bubbles doesn't think she's ugly. She's not. In pain, feeling bad, had to rebuff Levin. Oh, Bubbles. Ah, alas. 
Love is such a complicated uh, affair. Um, it's especially complicated if it is an affair. Uh, right, no, no, Wilson, Wilson, try and, in try and intercept them. Come on, Wilson, you can do it. You can do it. You move faster than they do, I hope. Come on, Wilson, no, they're getting away. Come on. No, Wilson, they're getting away. He's kind of catching up every now and then. Come on, Wilson. <laughs> if you actually managed to intercept them now. No. <laughs> Damn it. I'm not sure I would have wanted him to once it got to about there, because it's like, do you realize how much effort it's going to be to haul all this stuff back? Uh, Dark Havoc, would you, would you finish these off just to, you know, get them out of there? That would be grand. Thank you. And then this one as well. Thank you. And uh, let's make sure they actually hold, if we can, please. There we go. Let's get all of this sorted, shall we? I think it is important. In fact, could you also work on the slate walls? That would additionally be pretty pretty good. Uh, we can shut all of these weapons down now, which is glorious. And on the whole, I'm fairly happy with that. Very, very happy. Visitors! Let's have a look at you. Um, how many visitors are there? Uh, there's enough that we're going to probably have to uh, change these beds over to visitor beds. There you go. That way you can all, like, chill out. Uh, if I have a look at one of the visitors, I'd actually like to set this up a little bit better. I would like you to only have access to the guest areas. Uh, that shouldn't be the guest area, really. But you can have access to the guest areas. And in the guest areas, you may buy things and also entertain um, but I would like to remove this area from the guest area there's no reason for you to go down here none at all you can go there that is the only place you're allowed you can be kind of outside and you can just chill out buy food you know just enjoy yourselves in the awesome rooms that we've got but otherwise no will you please stop bleeding everywhere what on earth happened you were cut. Who cut you? Hmm. I think they may have had a little bit of a, a little bit of a, a falling out with each other, and uh, no doubt I'm going to be the one get, uh, punished for it. Hospitality is going up now. Good. Liking it. Very nice indeed. Okay. Uh, what else be going on at the moment? Then we've got loads of things in here. Honestly, it's. It's high time that I do a certain something that I've been putting off for a long time. Right, we don't need this anymore. That's just, it's, it's a distraction. It's in the way. Let's get rid of it. Once that is gotten rid of, in fact, let's uh, prioritize the getting rid of, we are going to build ourselves, finally, after much time, where is it? A comms console. Really should have had one of those a long time ago, but you know me. It's always one of the last things I build. And we'll get something in there. I don't really care about these areas, but let's uh, try and hook them up, I guess. Um, yeah, we'll have a lot in here. Because I see no reason not to use this as, as storage space, frankly. I mean, it's just a cavity that serves no other purpose otherwise. So if we get all of that set up properly, then it should be good. And there we go. And how's everything going down there? Good, that's right. Treat our guests. Make sure that they're nice and and uh, healthy. Well done. Well done indeed. I approve. Getting some more slate blocks done. Good. All right then. Um, I think with... Oh, actually. These should... Let's uh, make sure to copy these settings and then paste them over there so that we don't store anything in those uh, locations. But with that, I think we're sorted for the time being. Unless, no, okay, we've got something else. Tribes people this time. Lots of. Ah, it never rains when it pours. Very well. We're not going to be uh, going on a, on a slight cut whilst uh, I get uh, work done. We're instead going to be going back to uh, restricting everyone indoors. Uh, Janet, yes, please, please uh, get all of that sorted for me. Let's make sure that's all done, and quickly, please. And make sure all of these are turned on. Go. Get them sorted. Come on, Jana. No? Please? Please now? Do now? Yes? There we go. We don't need you to uh, head to battle stations just yet, but it's gonna get there soonish. Ish being the, uh, the operative word there, I think. 
Um, yeah, sure, you can uh, go ahead and just haul things in there. That's fine. Once they decide to attack... Oh, there they go. All right. Need everyone drafted and down here. And I, this time I'm actually going to set up your uh, your defensive positions, honestly. High time that I did that. Let's get you there. Let's get Flurgles. Flurgles, you can stand down there along with Horror Story. Let's get you into position. Dark Avoc, you can go there. Rhapsody, obviously inside. KD, inside. Um, Janet, don't need you wielding that anymore. Uh, you're not a great shot, but I'm going to give you an assault rifle anyway. And you can now stand there. Bubbles behind Kaya. Um, Wilson behind Dark Avac. Valerie there. And Madden there. There we go. I think that sorted. Oh, oh. No, 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 no. Don't follow Dark Havoc around when he's fighting. This is bad time. Oh, no. This is bad. Super bad times. Uh, there we are. Let's shift and uh, set position. So this way we don't have to worry about it in the future. And we've already got a couple of kills. Thankfully, they don't seem too interested in... Ca oh, no. I think some of them have, have picked up the scent of our guests. Hopefully we can kill enough people in here that it drives them away. But I think we're about to lose Priscilla. Uh, no, apparently we are not, in fact, about to lose Priscilla. Okay. Not sure what you're up to. Are you attack- you, you set fire to my wooden horseshoe pin! What a jerk move! No words for how, how much of a jerk you were there! Of all the things you could have done, you just did that to be annoying. You, you've more or less accepted you're gonna die, and you're like, yeah, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go down here, and I'm gonna set fire to your horseshoe pin. Take that, you scalawags. Uh, I seem to imagine them saying. And let's get out there and just kill people as fast as you can, please. There you go. Perfect. And they're breaking. I am not at all surprised by that. Could you please put out the fires? Dark Avac, yes, no. Also Kaya, put out the fires. There we go. Sorted. And someone go and... Uh, okay, Dark Avac's like, nah, it's okay. Uh, you can just charge after people and kill them. The rest of you, you're all free to go. Just go and do your thing. Get out there. Put out as many fires as you can. Dark Havoc will chase people down and try and kill them. Uh, but everything else seems... <laughs> wow, so much death. When will they learn? When will they learn? Uh, Dark... Someone re super badly needs to take care of this part. I feel. I feel that someone needs to. Because if someone doesn't, it's... Go oh, dear. It's, it's spreading. Please prioritize the fire. Bubbles, also prioritize the fire. Horror story, prioritize the fire. Go, go, go. Like right now, because this is gonna get nasty if you don't. There we go. Oh, all right, well done. Well done, could have been worse. Uh, did Dark Ava kill them? Not yet. Hopefully soon. Well done. Anyone else you can catch up to? Uh, maybe Ox. Go. Spider's behind you, so it's fine. You can, you can take them out later. Yeah, you're not going to catch Ox, are you? No. May as well turn back then and deal with Spider now, rather than later. Okay, so of the people that we have got incapacitated, anyone we particularly want, you're okay with melee, you're psychically dull, you're a pessimist and a uh, prosophobe, so that's a no. Uh, we have also got Bear, psychically sensitive, pyromaniac, and no. Uh, Galga, volatile, gay, well, that's not necessarily a bad thing. You love animals, but you're not very skilled with it, unfortunately. You're not bad at growing, though, so you're not possible. Too smart, fast walker, prostophobe. Incapable of none. Hmm. I think, KD, go capture Brexio. And we've also got Weasel. Trigger happy, pretty, slowpoke. Dumb labor. No. I think it's going to be Bear then. So, Rhapsody, could you capture Bear? There we go. Let's get these guys inside. The rest of you. Slow, agonizing, frost, burny death. And then eventual noms. Uh, except for Spider. Spider, you, I didn't check you properly. Exactly sensitive, gay. Uh, these in the cooking. Uh, I've already captured the other. Sorry, Spider, but it's not going to happen. There we go. I will give you a quick death, though, unlike the others. There you go. There we are. All sorted. Get everything fixed, please. And then bring in the corpses as soon as you can. They they won't last long. L what? 
I did I not notice these two? Lazy chemical fascination, ugly, and brio fast walker, careful shooter, ugly. Um, also kind of good, but oh dear, mad animal. Uh, we will not forbid that one. There we go. You're probably gonna die trying to get into the colony, or not? Maybe you won't. Thankfully, all of the guns are still turned on, so it didn't really matter. All right, on that note, though, let's turn the guns off. Thank you very much for making me aware that the guns are all still turned on. I would have missed that had it not been for your self-sacrifice there. I choose to believe you killed yourself just to make sure I didn't do a silly. Um, uh, they really enjoyed their stay. They left us granite blocks, meat, capybara meat. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. Got so many people to haul in. All right. Well, crack on then, everyone, because we've got lots of jobs to do. Have we actually installed anything? No, we haven't actually built any of the things I just told people to build, but that's going to be the case for a while. Uh, Dark Abacus probably does need rest, so yeah, we'll let you do that. You're also eating raw people, which is always something that the Dark Abacus likes a lot, so it's never really a bad thing. Um, let's make sure that everyone else is unrestricted now. Go ahead. And get everything back in order. All right, while you're working on that, let's uh, get this set up because we definitely want that to build. We'll also get the door there as well. And we'll get that sorted up too. Okay, not bad at all. If we can get this set up and start trading, that's going to be great. Ah, uh, Katie, binging on Ambrosia, really? Must you? But oh, Bubbles have been attacked by Lynx. No! Flee, Bubbles. Oh, actually, kill it, Bubbles. Damn it! Ah, oh, you've just had your, your little toe ripped off. Valerie, need your help. Get down here now. Dark Ava, need your help. Get down here now. Move. Come on, Bubbles. Take a shot. Take a shot. Take a shot, Bubbles. Can you actually shoot it? <gasps> no! No, Bubbles! No! <laughs> you were just trying to mine. Will someone please get down here? Bubbles! Eaten to death by a lynx. I can fix almost everything. No, Bubbles has, Bubbles has been torn to death. The lynx is just norming on Bubbles. Oh, what a way to die. <sighs> Who'd have thunk it? Well, no, 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 you don't get to be like, oh, but I'm not hungry anymore, so it's fine. No, 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 you're gonna die. Get in there, Dark Out. Oh. Only Bubbles would use their shotgun. Uh, alas. Now we need to bury Bubbles. Dark Ava, could you please bury Bubbles? Thank you. How suckful. Uh, at least you died doing what you loved. Mining, apparently. Bubbles really liked mining. Right, let's have a look at your sarcophagus. It's good. Oh, that's nice. Uh... Desirous bubbles, ooh. The sarcophagus bears a portrayal of a stream. The work is infused with the idea of intimacy and is done in a photographic style. The scene seems to take place on the outskirts of a community. It's not particularly representative of anything that Bubbles did in her life, but perhaps Bubbles had time to talk with, with other people in the colony and, and, and share her sensitive soul. And this is, this is the, the, the only thing the Dark Ava could think of, the best thing the Dark Ava could think of to, to send her on her way to the next life. Just, just this, this romantic kind of scene. That, that's actually kind of lovely. Well done, Dark Ava. Sometimes you don't disappoint. However, I want you to start butchering all the people in there. Uh, and also Rhapsody, could you go and take care of Valerie? There we go. Ah, oh, my lord. That... It was going so well. So well, until Bubbles got eaten by a lynx. Which is a fair statement, I feel. Uh, let's get all of that done as well. Now we're down one amazing miner. Uh, do we have anyone who's primary on mining now? We don't, actually. That's a pain, but, uh, okay. Uh, no doubt the colony's gonna be in a pretty, pretty sour mood for quite some time. In fact, let's actually have a look at people's, uh, people's feelings. Uh, my friend Bubbles died. Oh, how many people are gonna have that? Uh, my friend Bubbles died. Okay, so Dark Ava cared more than KD did. My friend's Bubble died. Rhapsody cared more than Dark Avak did. 
this is where we really find out who who likes you and who is just being polite. Um, Wilson didn't care. Wilson, you scoundrel. Um, let's see. Neither did Valerie. Valerie also a scoundrel. Does, uh, no, horror story. Really, you two? There, there we go. Flugel's kid, more than in KD at least. Uh, and <laughs> Madden, scoundrel. My friend Bubbles died. Uh, Kaya, kid, only slightly less than Rhapsody did. Well done, Kaya. And 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 Jana, I'll give Jana a pass because Jana only just joined. Jana hadn't really had the time to sit down and have those talks about hopes and dreams and aspirations with Bubbles that everyone else had the opportunity to, but only like four of you took. You scoundrels. We will be making a list. We'll be making a list of all the people who didn't care. And then don't think you're going to be getting a nice sarcophagus. You might get a grave. Maybe. It might actually have a tombstone also. Possibly. Yeah, uh, it will have a tombstone. We, we won't give you an unmarked grave, but you are scallywags. Oh, uh, my goodness. Uh, well. Right, Dark Elf, can I get you to work on this, please? Let's get that up and running. I'm really sad. Another colonist died. I'm not used to losing this many colonists. Damn it. A uh, group of tra travelers passing by. That's always good to, to know. But we do need to get things indoors and set up, please. There we are. Fantastic. We now got our console set up. Could you continue working on the butcher table now? There we go. Let's get all of these people chopped up as soon as possible. Also, anything in here that shouldn't be in here, please move out as well. Exhaustion. Dark Havoc. He's doing too many things. Uh, he has to, though. It's how he keeps his mind off the fact that Bubbles died. Uh, right. Well, hopefully we can get the rest of these traps set up fairly soon. Not that it would have helped the Bubbles, really. Thinking about it, uh, maybe if we popped a few down there. But honestly, the, the animals just don't seem to have to deal with any kind of uh, trap issues. They get in here all the time without incident. Which is a little bit frustrating i'll be perfectly honest not that again that would have particularly uh been an issue for for the lynx attacking bubbles because bubbles was outside that as much as it was an annoying death it was one that is in many ways unavoidable if you've got anyone doing work outside the, the corner i mean you can avoid it by making sure that you have like shifts of people watching over anyone that the people only go outside together in groups so that there's always backup but that one, uh, that one's a fairly common birth. Uh, so it's not common birth. Sakura is just given birth. Uh, that's a common way for people to die, unfortunately. Uh, loads of people being sick, though. Uh, oh, yes, they did have some uh, food poisoning, didn't they? Hmm. Fortunately, we've also got a lot, lot of them there, which is not the best thing in the world. Let's make sure that everything is set to uh, rearm. Uh, Auto rearm, good. That is due to be rearmed. Okay, well, we're going to pass a little bit more time now, and uh, hopefully soon we're going to get some traders nearby, and uh, then we'll possibly be able to make use of this comms console, depending on what they want. In the meanwhile, I'll just get things built, and I will bring you back when there is something to report. Okay, well, Wilson here has need of a 12th rib. I do believe that we actually have... A rib available somewhere. Now, let me have a quick look at your your needs in general. Uh, feeling bad, but human like, yeah, various things. But if we gave you a pain, I don't think you're in, ever in pain, really. But you know what? You've got a missing 12th rib, so let's uh, get the painkiller rib installed there. Also, for the time being, I would like you to go and rest until healed over there whilst we get that sorted. Next up, who has got a missing part? Ooh, you've got quite a few. Uh, left pinky, right ear, so we want a bionic arm. Let's uh, make one of those. Uh, bionic ear. We also want a bionic eye. Let's add that in then. So, bionic eye. What do we need for this? A light receptor, some plasteel, some components. All right. Uh, light receptor. There we go. What do we need for that? Just some plasteel and components. So, we should have everything to fix horror stories issues there. Right, Dark Avat, can you please prioritize working 
on Wilson. Let's make sure Wilson is getting the best possible uh, medication. He is, hopefully, if we've got any in the colony. Uh, what are you doing? There we go. Yes, good. So some proper medicine. Not much heat in there. I do apologize. Um, what's the heat in this room? Only 10 degrees. Not very good. Please. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, so Wilson is sorted. Very, very nice. You will now not have much in the way of, of pain, or well, rather, it will be reduced by one tenth. I wonder if you could. I wonder if this is cumulative or absolute. So, if you had ten of them, you would no longer be capable of feeling pain, or the second one would give you ninety percent of the pain that you were feeling, which was already ninety percent, and the, you, you know, until there would always be a little bit of pain. But you know, once you got like ten, it's going to be ridiculous. Uh, uh, Boomerang has been named unstoppable. Funnily enough, I think there is a way of stopping one. You let it do what it wants to do. <laughs> Usually works. Uh, right, what's Dark Havoc up to at the moment? Draining Boomrat 35 very well. I'm super happy that Wilson is now set up there. And it has no negative effects, which is rather glorious. All right, okay, so these are going to take a little while. Flurgles, what you up to? Uh, crafting prosthesis, thank you. If we can get all of that sorted. We're now at the point where we can start just upgrading people without too much concern, and that is amazing. Would love it if these would get um, set up as well, but uh, it's taking a little bit of time, unfortunately. Additionally, getting all these things hauled, yeah, it's not happening very quickly. In fact, to the point that I'm really tempted to just expand this stockpile out and allow it all the way around, just to get these things out from over there so they're not just break, uh, breaking down over time. That shotgun, for example, is a nice shotgun. We don't want to waste it if we can avoid that. But since Bubble's death, nothing much new has happened. And we're just continuing on the way we've been continuing on. Horror Story is currently making a new bionic ear, which is rather awesome. Um, crafting. Have you already done the light receptor? Really? That's pretty impressive. Uh, the bionic ear is sorted. What are you going to work on next? If anything. Are you working on anything next? You are... Let's see, was that the light receptor, perhaps? Yeah, so you're going to work on the bionic eye. Fantastic. Now, we'll try and do all of the um, operations at the same time. That way we don't have to uh, use too much anesthetic. Uh, though, of course, you know, there's always a chance that it'll go horribly, horribly wrong. And Horror Story will come out much worse than when she went in. Maybe whilst trying to install the bionic eye, I don't know, someone will accidentally take out her heart or something. Okay, Kaya's developed a health condition heart attack. You get. Dark Havoc, now. I need you I need you around where Kaya is. Right now. Move. Fast. Kaya, where are you going, Kaya? Oh my lord, please Kaya, no. Wherever you're going, try and get over here, please. Get to a bed, rest until healed, go now. Dark Havoc's gonna escort you over there. Are you actually having a heart? You are. Kai's like, ah, I'll walk it off. I'll walk it off. Marvelous, but crazy. Okay, please. And there we are. It's like straight up treatment success. Really? Because it hasn't gone away. No, it has. Well done, Dark Havoc. My goodness, only a 59% chance though. So, you know, there was a, a not insubstantial chance that he would fail several, several times. So I'm pretty happy that that actually didn't go horrible. Horror Story is making their own eye. That's fantastic. Uh, what did we just lose? Oh, all the power here. That is a bit rough, but all right. We're recharging it at least. Uh, there we go. Horror Story, if you can get that sorted, then you're going to be super happy with the result, I'm sure. Where's Flurgles right now? I'm making Nutramine out. Actually, oh, do we not have what we need? We need 55 steel, 35 plast steel, and three components. What are we lacking? Well, it's not the components. Uh, it's not the plast steel. It is the steel. Okay. Right then. Time for us to continue looking for more stuff. Then uh, let's head on up to ten. Drag that out. Without bubbles, these things are just not getting done. Makes me very sad. I will confess. Very, very sad. But it is what it is. Valerie's getting up there, though. Thank you, Valerie. 
Um, everything else kind of moving along as usual. And hopefully we'll get an opportunity to try and trade with these guys before they leave. But we'll have to see about that. At any rate, I'm going to lay down a cut here and I'll bring you back if something interesting should happen. I swear, every time it says Rose has died because of cold, I start looking around for a husky that's named Rose. Uh, such a troll message there. Why can it just be, a plant has died because of the cold? Uh, alas. However, we've almost finished all of this. We have lost a large amount of our produce due to uh, the cold. As we had that just before nightfall, and it wasn't enough then to keep the heaters running, which was kind of terribly bad luck, really, for us, but oh well. Um, down here, we really do need a little bit more wood, though. Have we got any more trees? We do. It's just that there's so much other stuff to do in the colony, and we're never getting around to it. You can, you can just turn your sights elsewhere, Milado. You are not going to be causing any trouble for me down here. Uh, they expected more from us. Oh... Well, they, they left us some approach, though. That's good, I guess. Um, goodbye. Oh, well. Uh, right. Well, at the moment, nothing much more has happened. So we're still passing a little bit of time. I am thinking, though, increasingly, that it might be a good idea for us to set up some power down here just to help out in this little area. Because it's, it's running on very, very little power right now. And it's got a lot of things that want power, which is... Not a great place for us to be. But back to waiting. Okay. Horror Story is finished with Bionic Eye. We have yet to mine out the steel that we need to finish the prosthetic arm. So we're just going to go ahead with this one. And let's get the Bionic Eye installed in the left eye socket. There we go. And also the right ear installed. So... Uh, yeah, that was correct. Where's the ear? Install bionic ear in the right ear. Okay, go and rest until healed. Dark Havoc will be along shortly to try and make sure you don't die horribly. That's always the uh, the goal, really, here. Uh, where are you? There we are. And please go ahead and work on Horror Story. Hopefully you can get equally good meds. Yes, you can. Fantastic. And I think with this... We're going to be wrapping things up. Oh, Ripley is being attacked by an Arctic Wolf. Why? No! No, Dark Havoc, we need you! Ah, oh, Scallywags! It waited. It waited until it knew the Dark Havoc was in this post. Ah, oh, you Scallywag. Why are all my animals dying? Mostly to other animals. Flugels! Flugels! No! Quickly, get down there! Ah, oh, it will be too late. Ripley has been ripped apart. Please protect the body. Uh, no, Ripley don't, it doesn't even get buried. Worst day ever. Uh-oh, pull back. That's right, ha-ha, take that. Uh, right, get you down here, there we go. Just take shots. Madden over there, please. More shots, all of the shots. Yeah, you'll regret eating our puppies, you scoundrel. Ah, so sad. We've lost so many things. We've lost a puppy and a person. Worst day ever. And get it hauled in, I suppose. Right. Uh, horror story. How did it all go? Uh, has it even been done? Right. Bionic Eye is in. Dark Havoc has had to go and get more. Uh, no, not anesthetic, but just more meds ready for the uh, remaining surgery. And there we go, Bionic Ear Implant! Hooray! At the very least, Horror Story didn't, I don't know, well, again, Dark Havoc trying to install the ear, accidentally removed the left leg. It happens with this game, unfortunately. But that's going to be where we're going to wrap things off. A bit of a uh, dire note, we've lost two colonists, two members of the family. One of them can't even be buried because most of it, or in fact all of it, was eaten. Uh, we didn't even get to bury all of Bubbles, let's be perfectly honest. Uh, such a rough time. But that is going to be it from me. I hope you've enjoyed, though, and will be joining me for the next where Hopefully, we'll get this set up, and maybe at some point, we're finally going to receive uh, a communique from uh, some passing trader who wants to buy all of our stuff that we don't actually want. We'll have to see. But that's it from me. So until next time, and as always, to take care, everyone.